So we have national networks, we have regional organizations, we have local organizations, um, and we all come together through this concept of grassroots internationalism. There was a delegation of folks from a lot of actually some folks in this room went to the World Social Forum in Porto Alegre and were blown away by the movements they were seeing in Brazil and seeing how many numbers the, uh, the landless movement could turn out, how many numbers, La Via Campesina, it was like tens of thousands of people and we're like, oh, we need to be doing that in the United States. <laughs> so, um, and, and really also inspired by the politics of those movements. And so really wanted to come back to the US and actually build an alliance that is actually um, gonna bring together, not only converge us across our sectors here in the United States, which is very important, but also infuse a global perspective into the local and regional work that we're doing in the United States. We're well aware that part of the challenge in the U.S. is our movements and what it takes to just fight the fight of where we're located and the importance to then be connected to something broader. organizers into this conversation about what's the new world we want to build together. What is the new economy we want to build? How are we going to save the planet? Um, and build a place that I can raise my children, our grandchildren, our great-grandchildren in uh, with dignity. The most exciting thing for me is to meet all the people that are doing work on the ground helping their communities to transition away from coal or gas or fossil fuels into building the world that we all want to build. These are all important things uh, for our communities, for our organizations, and for our country. And what I'm really excited about, it has a very clear uh, anti-capitalist orientation to it, uh, and it's going to give us an opportunity to build in our communities uh, and connect up with some of the important uh, social justice movements across the globe. A lot of us um, live on a daily basis in the radical imagination of what something new can be. And that, the, that, that, that basically life can be just, dignified, and fair, and where we can have our full humanity, and it doesn't have to be at the basis of money and profit and exploitation and of oppression. No war! No warming! Build the people's economy! We're fighting because we think that we can actually win. And the same level of audacity that they have to do heinous, heinous things around the globe has to be dwarfed by the level of audacity that we have to fight for the liberation of all people and the planet. No war. No warming. Build an economy for the people and the planet.